wondering whether or not you can use your cell phone when traveling overseas. Download fiber, find Wi-Fi connection, the person who you're calling, make sure they have Wi-Fi connection and have downloaded fiber, you can talk to them. Number two, currency converter. You don't want to spend too much money, money that you don't really have. You want to enjoy your time and make sure that you keep account of all your funds. Download the currency converter. Number three, TripAdvisor. Captain Obvious. However, TripAdvisor is the perfect app to have when traveling internationally. Places to eat, good tourist attractions, transit routes. Perfect. Make sure you download that. Uh, sorry. Step program. The State Department has an app called the Step Program. Basically, when you're traveling internationally, you want to register with that country's embassy. That way, in case you lose your passport, you get arrested, uh, you get caught smuggling crack cocaine in the Greece, whatever your issue is, you can contact that embassy, and that way they'll readily have your information available. Step Program. Download that app. Number five, Airbnb. Sure, it makes sense to get a nice hotel room in a foreign country, but if you want to be frugal, such as the sovereign space, I highly recommend you download the app Airbnb. You can rent an apartment, you may, may even be able to find a nice little hostel, but it provides a perfect alternative as opposed to just getting the traditional hotel room. Number four, 